can't believe that I've seen 50 years of ministry. I was thinking back to the summer of 1965. I was 18 and God had really begun to work in my life. I was climbing uh, in the Lake District with a friend on holiday from university. And I'd been running a youth club not very far from where I'm sitting here in Brighton. And I realised that God was calling me and, and, and turning my leadership commitment into a commitment to ministry. The changes in me coincided with changes here in Brighton. The summer of 65 was dominated by fights on Brighton seafront between the mods that arrived on their scooters with Bertram Parkers and the rockers on their motorbikes in leather jackets. And I remember how they squared up to one another on the stony beaches <laughs> and the fights would break out. And then the Brighton police in their distinctive white helmets would come and arrest people, dragging them off and we'd watch some run away. And the youth club I was leading got the local overspill in the summer, it was the overspill from the fights down here on the beaches. And in the winter, it was the spillover from the football violence that was just beginning. I remember sort of asking who won today. And the youth would very often reply with who'd won on the terraces rather than the result on the pitch. It was an interesting time with local mods and rockers and football fans all coming into the youth club on a Saturday and Sunday night. Sometimes in the winter, one of their number would find the main switch and plunge the whole building into darkness so that they could start throwing chairs and chains at each other. And I got quite adept at crawling along the floor, getting to the main switch, turning it back on, putting the lights back so that we got some order so the evening could be finished with some Bible teaching. And sometimes when the lights were back on, everything quietened down and the Word of God really just cut through. And to be honest, that was the moment at which the lights came on in some people's lives too. I must admit that even in those days, I would preach peace with God as the key to establishing peace between people. So perhaps it's good that we've come here to the peace statue. It stands between Brighton and Hove, two towns that have come together as one city. And I've got lots of memories. I must admit that it has changed a bit, but some things haven't changed and the word of God certainly hasn't changed. It can still transform people's lives. I've preached many times since those days of chaos in the youth club and much of it has been recorded. To mark these 50 years in ministry, I want to make that Bible teaching resource available to everyone everywhere for free. We have people all around the world who really appreciate my regular emails, but many of them cannot afford to download my Bible teaching. This is a real disappointment to them and to me and I want to remove this barrier. By having you as a partner standing with me, we can make everything that I've recorded available for free. And together we can see more and more people discover the power and the peace that comes through God's Word. Congratulations, Hugh, in celebrating 50 years of ministry. Having known you for over 20 years, I've really benefited from your amazing ability to teach God's Word and to bring it into everyday context. I know for myself, when I was starting out in a pastoral ministry, it was great to have access to the resources that you made available. And to know now that you're making these resources free online for so many people, not only in the UK but beyond, 
I think is a tremendous act of grace. Therefore, I want to challenge every single one of you who's listening to this to partner with you so that more and more people can access these truths and get some insight into the wisdom that God has given him in over 50 years of ministry. So once again, Hugh, thank you. And I want to challenge every one of you, partner with Hugh, so that we can spread the word of God and spread that word into everyone's context. God bless you. Thank you.